Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Hey, I'm super excited for this video. This is kind of a departure for the types of videos I've done so far. You know, if you've watched my videos, you know I kind of started this to help people decide if they want to get into gun ownership so they can protect their homes, their families, and um, just kind of a learning process. So I've not actually done a true gun review. Um, so yeah, pretty excited about it. I have a new product out here that you know, there's a lot of controversy over what kind of firearms they're going to allow us to own if they're going to come get our, you know, AR-15s or that sort of thing, which I haven't purchased one of those because, you know, it's kind of on the fence, you know, if they're going to come take it, why do I want to spend my money now and, and get one if they're just going to confiscate it? But I have before you, and I'm about to show it to you, this is the first truly Washington-approved um, firearm for, for home safety defense so and it's it gonna be a departure for what you're used to it's not your traditional nine millimeter it's not a 45 it's it's not any of that it's not an AR um, it's not a carbine this is totally unique but you can purchase this with no worries from your congressman or anybody on the on either political party so without further ado here it is this is the long-awaited NRF Banshee Blaster. I tell you what, guys, you're gonna like it. Now, first off, just to show you, this is clear. Chambers are empty, everything else, so it's, it's safe to handle right now. You know, I just wanna get that public service announcement out there for you. But guys, this is cool. Like, I'm really, I haven't taken it to the range yet, but so it's semi-automatic, so it's not fully automatic. It doesn't have a scary switch for everybody, so, you know, it can calm down on it. Um, it does have, so it's got a forward grip. It does have, for all you guys who really like one, you know, it's got a safety, because it's got a fairly light trigger on it. So you have to depress the safety on it. There's a little bit of take up and wind up on this. I don't know if you can hear this or not. There's some wind up on it. But then, and again, it's empty, so I could dry fire this, but it is semi automatic. And it's got a stock for aiming, you know, so you can get a good grip on it. It's got a nice visible sight on it. Um, so, but then you can get this without a tax stamp and no worry about it. So, I would encourage all of you guys, I mean, right now you can go out and purchase this and you don't have to get, you know, like what you do for some weapons you don't have to get a federal tax stamp or anything like that for it so but public service announcement you know with the upcoming legislature I would if you're considering getting one of these I would go out and do it right now because technically this is a 20 round magazine and it is a rotary magazine so they may take that away um, it fires a four inch projectile and they come you know the different calibers are different colors so you can you can choose what you want to use use it for when you take this to the range so get into the self-defense aspect of it so this gun it's it's different it's gonna be learning curve like you know we're taught to go for center mass to stop your attacker this particular one and well, this is also approved by the hands across the highway safe space coalition coalition excuse me so the object of this one is you want to shoot for the eyes and poke their eye out so you can run away and get safe. But it's going to be a new training thing. But you know, like I've said to everybody, if you're going to own a firearm, you need to train with it and be safe. Because if you're not going to be safe, you're not going to be affected with it. And watch how easy this is to load. I mean, you just pop them in. And I won't bore you with the whole 20 rounds. But then you spool it up and you get ready, you get that wind up going. I'm not going to put my finger anywhere near the trigger on this because it is now loaded. But guys, you can go out and get this and nobody in Washington or your local enforcement is going to give you any problems with it. We found a loophole to get around the assault rifle ban that might be coming up. Whew. Boy, I'm glad I got that out of the way. So, i tell you what, if you guys like this video... I would really appreciate it if you'd like it and share it and subscribe it, share it with your friends. 
so we can get awareness out about this new thing because there's nothing scary about this. Everybody will approve it. You don't have to be afraid. All right. Shoot safe and keep training. Have a good night. Hey guys, a supplemental video. Um, I forgot to tell you a couple things that I have heard lately. Um, the same people that may be coming after your firearms and your right to protect yourself may, they may be attacking professional sports too. Two in particular. So, football, they, I, from what I've heard, um, you know, this is a dangerous, dangerous time. So, I've heard they're going to have to start playing flag football instead of full contact now. And the reason being is they've done a lot of studies and full contact sports may lead to the, to the you know, development of boo-boos for those who are very sensitive um, and they can't have that. Also, baseball. They are proposing bans on bats made from anything other than foam rubber because... It can be used as an assault weapon, and they do, they they don't think anyone other than our military or you know the private bodyguards of people in politics should have something that could cause that much damage in their hands. I can't confirm these, but I've heard them, so I just wanted to pass it along to you guys. All right, have a good night.